Okay, welcome back. So, I'm pretty excited. I've got a new book here. We're going to um, head out to age 52 in, in just a minute. First, I would like to point out that I made a, a nice little house. Um, it's I was kind of short on materials, so it's a little lacking. Like, the fact that it's two blocks high, which bothers me a lot, but oh well, it's cozy. Um, we've got our, our Duskwood book here. Um, by the way, leaving books on the ground does damage them over time, so eventually they'll just disappear. I don't know how long it takes for them to disappear, but they will disappear, so you don't just want to leave your books on the ground. Um, but you can leave them in this thing, and it, and if it rains on them, then they'll get hurt. Or snows, I guess, technically, or if water hits them. Uh, well, that I don't know if that would actually hit it and knock it off or destroy it or what, but, you know, it, it, it acts like books do. So, um, just keep your water away from your books. <clears throat> and uh, so it's safe in here now. Can't be rained on. Um, and we can just teleport there whenever we want. But first, before we do go to the next place, I want to put it in here and come in and I want to see what happens because, okay, beach biome, that's kind of neat. What happens when it's a single biome that's a beach biome? <laughs> um, that's, that seems odd to me. I kind of want to see what that looks like. We'll put it to bright. It'll be like a vacation place. Um, no lakes. It'll fill in the rest by itself, which means that there, as long as I don't put in enough, there's still a chance for it to um, to spawn some some weird things. Um, and yeah, so okay, let's take this out and uh, go ahead and use it. I guess we've got stuff on, so we've got a, a linking book, so we can get back. Here we go. <coughs> <laughs> it's oh god so much sand guys 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 look at all the sand oh my god sand for days sand for years oh man jeez well you know I guess this is a good place to harvest sand from um Seems like there's nothing in this place but sand. So that's cool. Um, so yeah, I guess this will be where I grab my sand from if I want to get some sand. Ever. What's that over there? You know, I'm I'm hoping we'll get a world with a starfisher so I can... Oh, my shovel broke. Just grab the rest of this with my hand. No? Thought I heard lava. I thought I heard it again there, but I, I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy. But yeah, I would like to find a starfisher, because that'd just be, you know, neat to show off. It's the neat thing. Um, that's that's not a starfisher. There, it's supposed to be near the spawn, which I've totally lost track of now. <laughs> um, which is pretty easy to, considering. I mean, look at this place. It's just sand everywhere. Um, of course, this place could still be unstable, so I don't want to stay here too long. Um, but I do want to look for, like, abnormal... That looks a little weird. I don't know. I'm looking for things to start shifting, because if things start moving, that means get out. Particularly if it's, like, dirt. If you see dirt start falling, then that means you're in a bad place and you need to get out. Um, with this sand, it's going to be a little bit harder to tell. Okay, doesn't look like there's any starfishers around, which is unfortunate, but we'll get back and, and check out our book and see what this one has to offer. What time is it? Is the sun moving? The sun is not moving. Okay, so we've got eternal noon um, as a, a time now, which is good. Because that's actually kind of what I wanted here, because I was like, Psh, let's make it all... Like, I made it bright. What? Well, I love it. It's 15. I guess that's normal. I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's brighter at night, if it's like that. Anything falling? No. Okay. Let's go home. Oh, oh, I'm on the roof. <laughs> okay. Let's pick up age 52. Oh, we can't see it until we put it in here. 
Okay, bright, normal weather, eternal day, standard terrain. So, normal weather means it'll probably rain. I think. <clears throat> I think. Um, at some point or another in there, which is kind of unfortunate, because it would have been cool if we could get it to just, like, be sunny all the time. But, yeah. Um, standard terrain, I don't know what that'll do to beach. Maybe it just generates normally, but with beach instead. Um, uh, okay. I don't, I don't know what I'm going to name these things. I'm just naming them off the top of my head, so... If you have a problem with it, deal with it. Let's make us... Oh, another... Link book stand. And we'll set that down here. And put this book in there. Now we've got two. One that we can get... Uh, wood in, I guess. Or dark wood, at least. And one that we can get sand from. So that's pretty cool. I'm liking that. Let's make another one. I'm just like super excited to run around and, and see all these all these worlds that we can create. Okay, we're gonna need that, and then we're gonna need a link book as well. Oop, oop. Let's just make one of those. Okay, so we have a linking book. Let's put this sand here. And I accidentally destroyed my furnace because I swapped to my axe at the very last second when I was mining it on accident. And now it's gone, so that's cool. Um, let's go ahead and get some of that sand smelting, actually. Um, okay. Not much, though, because I don't have much coal. <laughs> I'm going to have to go caving soon. Really soon. Um, where did I put my wood? Is it in this chest? Yeah, I put a bunch of wood in this chest. There we go. Okay, um, let's go ahead and... Um, let's check out our, our notebook. We've got those ones. Alright, single biome, medium biome. Standard lighting, bright. Lakes. Standard terrain and void. Normal time, eternal dusk, eternal day. And normal weather and eternal rain. Okay, so nothing like... Huh, I mean, I don't know. Nothing particularly cool, I guess. Is what I was trying to say. Just a bunch of normal stuff. Oh, oh, jeez. What? <laughs> what? What is going on here? That's not normal. That's definitely not normal. I need to... I, I really need to see what's the deal with this one. Because this is definitely jungle. Where are those chickens? I hear them everywhere. I want to kill them all for their feathers. But I think they're all <laughs> under the in the trees here. So, and of course I'm not going to get like any foot. Oh, I got two feathers. Okay. Fine, fine. If you want to be that way. Um All right. So that's neat. Uh if we want snow, we can come here. I guess we could go to the tiger to Duskwood. Remember to call it that. Ooh, and there's a, a big flat flatness thing. Cows. Sweet. That's pretty cool. Oh, tons of chickens. Some sheep would have been nice before. Go and kill spiders for all my beds. And is it the snow that's lagging me or the the generating stuff? I'm not sure. This might be a flat world, actually. You know, now that I look around, it looks pretty flat. Um. So this might just be an entirely flat world, which is kind of neat. Um. That's a that's a good one to have. I don't know how deep the flat worlds are. Uh. What's our why? 129. They're pretty deep. Okay. I guess that answers our question. And the snow is falling constantly, so... Everything is just getting snow on it. Almost immediately. I like this field here. It's pretty awesome. Okay, let's teleport back and check out what the book says. Oh, this is so exciting, guys. I put torches up here so nothing would spawn on top. I don't really know how well that'll work, but... Um... You know. Okay. We have ice plains, jungle, jungle hills, medium biomes. Okay, so... Sky... Oh, Skylands! Strongholds, bright, eternal snow, fast time, cave world. Okay. What? I, um... I'm kind of confused. But I'm also really excited at the same time. Because we just got cave world, 
and Skylands here, and Strongholds, which I don't know what that'll do. We should make a cave world and a stronghold and stick them together and see what happens. Um, fast time, which means night and day should be shorter. Eternal snow. I mean, not ideal, but it's alright. I mean, it's good to have. Good to discover all of them, right? Uh, this is a world modifier for Skylands. Um, got a new weather one, new time one. Okay. I don't know what cave world means. But I want to make... I want to I want to figure out what it means. Really bad. Actually, uh, where does the flat world one come in? Was there a flat world one? I thought there was. Oh, no, it was just cave world and skylands. I don't know what that means. Like, I don't, I don't know how that ha came to be. Um... Um... Okay. <laughs> My names are gonna get worse and worse as time goes on, so don't expect it to be better than that. Like, Duskwood, that was a good one. I think I, I'm happy with that one. The rest of them are all kind of pathetic. Um... I guess we'll put Snowfall over here by Duskwood. Okay. And... I got a bunch of feathers, that's good. Um, leave one here. I have to make two books every time I go somewhere. One for the um, way there and one for the way back. I could have just made those at the same time, but I didn't. Scripted book, linking book. Okay. What I want to do is write in a... No. I want to write it. Where, did it. where was it? Other world modifier? Train generation. I want to write in a cave world and strongholds. Why not? Uh, I don't really know what those do with this. Um, I know I want to avoid having a lot of the same type. Like, if I were to just stick in all of these, it would probably cause a lot of corruption. Um, which, actually, that... Oh, I can just leave that in there. That's interesting. Um, that's actually strongholds. Cave World, Eternal Snow, Bright, Skylands. I worry that Skylands and Cave World are, are not good together. Which means that it could just not happen. So... <laughs> Ice Plains, Jungle, Jungle Hills, and Medium Biome. Okay, so it's... It's, it's got a Jungle and Jungle Hills, as well as Ice Plains, which is probably what we saw where all the animals were. Um, but it's constantly snowing. So, everything is like a snow place, including jungles, which is hilarious. Okay, so we have that. Let's let's make ourselves some more tools real quick before we go back there. Um, I need a shovel. I guess that's all I need. And I'll make a sword, too. Oops. And I guess an axe. There we go. That's good. Don't need much more than that. Um, I want to stick the rest of this crap in here. Enough space. Yeah. Okay, let's take that. And some more wood. I want to use up these odd-colored wood planks because they just add more space in my in my chest than they need to, which is unfortunate. I have some sticks in here. I should remember that next time. Okay. All right. Let's go. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Am I okay? The stars are moving very slowly. What the heck? Okay, maybe it was just slowly because it was going in a weird direction. Whoa, that's a lot of water down there. Oh, this place is cool, but it's so freaking dark. Like, can you guys see a lot here? I need to turn off my light so I can see better. <laughs> it looks so awesome in the, on the horizon. Um, I'm... Well, at least I'll know where this is because there's a torch right there. Hey, spider. 
How's it going? Yeah, it's been a long time since I've used a lot of, like, stone tools. Are we entirely encased here? Because I think we are. And that's pretty cool. Uh, particularly because there's even, like, water here. Even though we're entirely encased. It's like a ginormous underground lake. And theoretically there should be strongholds. Which is, like, even cooler. But remember, we've got to watch out for things dropping. Because I don't know what interferes. Um, I'm scared to go anywhere because there's mobs all over the place. Like, jeez. Are the stars moving? Because it's been at dusk over there for quite a while. No, get away from me. Uh, yeah, it's it's getting to be daytime. I mean, that doesn't help me any, because I'm, I'm underground. But it's daytime, regardless. Eat an apple. Come look over here. Oh, this is so cool. There's a tree over there, I think. It looks like a tree. I don't know if it is a tree. I mean, I guess it's close enough. Um, man, where do I go? I don't know where to go. I want to go everywhere. I want to go up. I want to go down. I want to swim around in the water. Oh, it's just so cool. Um, let's see if we can't make our way over to that side. Because, like, I want to stick to... The areas that I I know look safe. Well, not that this looks safe. Oh, good. Coal. Sweet. Okay, so, well, we know that stuff, like, ores and stuff spawn here. Which is good. We need ores and stuff. Um, I'd like to see my Y coordinate, 71. Alright. It's good to know, at least. Um, it's a little scary, because when you spawn... The gravel just falls from up above, all over the place. This place is so cool, guys. If I wasn't on far render distance, it probably wouldn't go all the way out like that, but... Look at, like, the greenish color to the... everything. It's just so awesome. Don't blow up. Actually, blow up. Just real quick. Okay, so it's not dirt all the way through. Hey! How's it going? I don't need you anymore. Nor do I need you. Or you. God, there's mobs everywhere. Okay, cave world is fun, but hard. That's my lesson here. I just got an iron sword. Yep, never using stone swords again. Never ever. Unless my iron sword breaks, in which case I'll probably use a stone sword again. Very quickly afterwards. Just eat these real quick. No, I was supposed to eat that there. But then I didn't. This is out. So cool. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Get away. Get away. Get away. Get away. Okay, I want to go home now. <laughs> I want to go home now. Let's go home. This place is cool, but uh, it's also terrifying. So look at that roof, though. Oh man. It's so cool. I want to see like a stronghold or something, but I'm afraid to go anywhere because I'm all. Not decked out in anything. Oh, let's go over here. <laughs> I don't want to go home yet. But Mom, I don't want to go home. Having so much fun. Oh, I'm also thirsty. I can go for some chocolate milk. Oh, God, guys. I love that chocolate milk. I think I have a problem. But honestly, I don't care. <laughs> um... I'm going to be one of those people who's like 40 and still drinks chocolate milk. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. Oh, God, guys. Does, isn't this so awesome? Oh, man. So cool. I'm terrified that things are going to start falling out from underneath me right now. <laughs> like, 
you don't know how scared I am right now that this whole world is just going to collapse underneath me. I mean, theoretically, this world would be safer than others, because floating platforms can, are unaffected by it. Um, it'll The decay blocks will... They'll fall through the bottom of the world and move anything above them, except air blocks, because you can't move air blocks. Um, they'll move any blocks above them down with them, as if they were like sand or gravel or something and were falling. Um, but air blocks don't count, so if you build a floating platform, then... Woohoo! Um... I don't know what happens if you go into a world that's been totally decayed. Uh, and I'm kind of afraid of finding out, because that would be kind of scary. I think there's a hole in the gr Oh, maybe that's just gravel. Okay, never mind. Okay, well, I'm, I'm bored now. Let's go to another world. <laughs> or at least back to ours. I want to find a world that's like... That's a good world. A good world that I can set up camp in, you know? Does time pass here? I need to check this time. When we go in this time, um, I need to check it out. Um, okay, I need another stand. Right, there's some sticks in here. That's not what I want to do. Here we go. <coughs> I want a world that's like... Oh, wait. Did I put this in here? Yeah, I just did so I could do that. Right, okay, What what is this? Ocean, frozen ocean, checkerboard biomes, that's interesting. Um, strongholds, cave worlds, those are the ones that I put in. Green sunset, dark, no weather, slow time. Okay, so it is slow time. I thought it looked kind of slow at first, but then I was like, uh, I have no idea. But it definitely was slow, so that's, that's good to know. <coughs> Dark is probably the worst it could have been for an underground one. Maybe I should have just put it in with a bright one. Maybe I'll make another one that's another cave one and uh, <coughs> set it to be bright. Oh, that's awful. That's terrible. I didn't notice that with those ones. But Oh. Oh. Oh, it thinks it's blocked off by another block. Or maybe I'm just out of range. Oh, yeah, that's it. Just out of range, doesn't show up. So now we have <laughs> the Rabbit Hole, the Dunes, Duskwood, and Snowfall. Those are some pretty cool worlds. Um, but I need more. <laughs> I'm just addicted to the to the age. Uh, I'm addicted to a thing, and it's called the age. And it's fantastic. It will change your life. It's a new kind of drug. It's, it's the anti drug I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about, guys. I'm just some crazy guy in a, in a tuxedo. I'm not in a tuxedo. I'm actually not even wearing a shirt. So, you're welcome for that image, by the way. For all of you who know me. Because I know you wanted it. Not that I'm fat or anything. I'm not. How much do I weigh? I think I weigh like 150. I'm not really sure, though. Uh, two bucks, right. I haven't weighed myself in a while. I used to weigh 150. I probably weigh less, actually, now. I don't eat much. Okay. I hate how I lose my linking book every time. That's making me angry. But, um, okay. So this one... Is there anything in particular that I want to put on it? Let's see. I want... I kind of want to put, um... Where, where's the, the uh... Weather train feature sky. I kind of want to put the green sunset on it because that was really cool. <laughs> but oh, I don't think I'm gonna. I want to, but if I did, then I wouldn't be able to get a different color. So yeah, no, I'm not gonna. Um, anything else though? Let's see. We've got lighting. I could put it. To, I could just set it to bright. To to see what it, that does. Oh, well, I clicked on it, so it's too late. I forget. Once you click on it, it just automatically puts it on, and you can't take it off. They are planning on adding a thing so that... Because this, this is a work-in-progress mod, by the way. I didn't say that in the first episode. I'll probably put it in the description, because I'm recording this almost immediately after. Um, they are working on a... Uh, 
thing. <laughs> a, uh... The mod is in progress, first off, so they are going to add a lot of stuff that I may or may not know about right now. And if I know about it, I'm not necessarily withholding it from you, I just don't remember. So, keep that in mind. Um... And, uh... And window. Window number two. Great! <laughs> Fantastic! Isn't this the most fanciest house you've ever seen? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Best house ever. I think I should win an award. Okay. Um, let's put that away. Put that away. We've got both books. Um, we've got some torches. We need some food. Oh, we don't have much food, do we? Crap. Um, let's cook some of this real quick. Should have been doing that before. Um, well, well, we'll go to this world. And, oh, no! I want that. Oh. You can't actually just throw them on the ground like as items. You have to throw them down as, as a book. That's interesting. Um, let's just go to this world. Oh, I should eat something first. Um, take some spider eyes with me. There we go. Oh yeah, delicious spider eyes. Wait for the poison to stop. Great. Okie dokie. <laughs> it's checkerboard pattern. Neat. Um, looks like it's checkerboard pattern planes and ice. Uh, ocean. Which is kind of an odd combination, to say the least. Um, <laughs> look at it. It's hilarious. Um, I don't really know if there's going to be much for us to do here. I mean, man, I can see straight through to the bottom. And these oceans are very... square. I wonder if the checkerboard pattern is supposed to apply to... Well, I mean, look, all the islands are really square. So maybe it's... But... <laughs> I'm confused. The chunks are all different... different these. But the, um... But... Okay, because when I was thinking checkerboard pattern, like, it looks like the biomes are checkerboard pattern, right? Because, let's say the border is right here, you can see it's island, 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 and ocean, ocean, ocean. So, it's checkerboard pattern like that with the biomes, but it's also checkerboard pattern with the ice and and the water. I mean, I guess it's possible that the wiki was just a little bit behind, or, or I missed something, but I'm really confused right now. <laughs> this is really weird. I don't know what to do with this. Okay. Well, let's head back. Maybe we've got a new one. Is the sun moving? I can't tell. I believe it is. Yes, it is. It looks like it's going normal time. Okay, well, that's good to know. It's hard to tell now that the clouds go the same direction. But yeah, so let's just head, head on back. Okay. Oh, crap. I forgot to check to see if time passes. Okay. Let's quickly grab this. Let's stick it in here and see what it's got. Uh, checkerboard biomes. Okay. It's bright. Normal sunset colors. Green sunset. Those are conflicting. That's going to be broken. No weather. Slow time. Oh, that is slow time. Okay. It looked normal to me. Maybe I just don't know how fast time passes. Um, okay, so we had checkerboard biomes, frozen ocean, and beach. Yeah. Okay. That's what I was expecting. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm tired. Okay, um... Green sunset, normal sunset. Green sunset is so much better! But I want more. I want more colors. Um... This one, because I feel like it's gonna be conflicting because it has normal sunset and green sunset. I think that'll probably be conflicting and it'll probably break the world. So I'm gonna put that one in here. But we did get some reads from there, which is cool. Um... I'm scared of going back into those places, though. Like, I want to, because I want to see if they decay over... Like, I want to see something decay, but I'm terrified of it, because I could totally get trapped there permanently, and and then I'd just have to end the, the playthrough, because I wouldn't be able to do anything. I'd just fall and die and fall and die and fall and die. Um, 
or if I do manage to build a floating platform, I'd get screwed. So, assuming that, you know, I didn't have a book ba a book to get back with, but... Book to... to, 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 to book to, to... Book... Okay, steak is done. Was that done when we left? I don't... Was... I don't know. Crap. <laughs> Come on, Ryan. You can do this. You can do better. I mean, a nexus. You can do better than that. I'm gonna stop calling myself my, my actual name. Not professional. Not that I actually... I mean, I don't really make money off of these. I tried making money off them for, at one point, but it didn't It didn't go very well. Let's just go for a totally random one. Oh, gee. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, I don't see a moon. So I'm assuming that means it's either eternal night or we're in a cave. Which means it's raiding through a cave, which is probably pretty weird. Um, mushrooms freaking everywhere. Oh yeah. Give me mushrooms. I don't want you. You're, you're a red thing. Can I kill these guys and get mushrooms from them? No. I need shears for that. I don't have any iron though. Oh, this is awesome. This is so awesome. Take cover under this tree. Skeleton, get away from me. Skeleton, get away from me. I don't want any. I don't want to be your friend. I don't want to be your friend. Get back. Stay away. You're not dead yet. Die. Thank you. Oh, well, now I need those arrows. Because I don't have many arrows, and those are pretty useful. I could also use that bone meal as well. Okay, well, uh, this place is awesome. Um... It's flat. It's mushroom biome. It's it's a lot of stuff. Okay, that just gives me dirt. I forget if this stuff spreads to dirt or not. Okay, I need to get out of here quick. The rain's freaking me out, and the darkness is freaking me out. Oh, it's crap! I forgot to check the time again. Oh, man. I'm so bad at remembering anything. Anything at all. Okay. Checkerboard, mushroom island, swampland. Seems about right. Normal swamp. Green sunset. What is with it in giving me green sunset and normal sunset colors on almost everything? Eternal storm. Oh, so it's even thunder? Oh, man. And it's dark. Wow, that's just bad. It's eternal rain and thunder and lightning and darkness. So, yeah. But now I can make just, like, checkerboard pattern mushroom island um, something else that's useful. I don't really know what else I would do. I guess forest? I don't know. Um, let's see, we've got dark, eternal storm, normal time, flat. Flat is good, I like flat. That makes for good... Um, for good stuff. Not copyright infringement because I'm not selling it, so... Yeah, that's not true. But, <laughs> don't listen to me! by the way, about anything. I don't want to be responsible for anybody doing something illegal, like copywriting things because they are thinking they could use something that was copyrighted because it, they weren't selling it. That would be bad. Okay, I want to take this and angle it. And then there will be another one there. Okay, which one are you? Snowfall goes in the, cor in the corner. Mushroom Kingdom goes here. Oh, boy. Such a mess. So many of them. Oh well. That's fine. Um, let's see. Well, I think I'm going to end this episode here. Because it's been an incredibly long time. And uh, we've gone through like five worlds this time. Man. Last time, I think we got Duskwood. And possibly Snowfall. No, I, I renamed Snowfall here. So... I think that was this episode. I don't remember. Get away from me! No! I don't like you. I wouldn't be able to sleep with this guy here, so I need to kill him. Not because he bothers me. Because I'd be perfectly safe inside my nice little... pathetic house. I heard footsteps, and I thought it, it, it scared me. That's what it did. Um, so let's sleep in the, in the wall a little bit. That's okay. I like to snuggle up to the wall when I'm sleeping. So, 
yeah, thanks for watching. Next time we'll we'll probably continue doing the same thing, trying to find like a fantastic world. Like, okay, what do we got here? I want. Um, I want. Oh, I want to make a Skylands world. Remind me next episode to make a Skylands world. Um, no weather is good on a world. Um, right now, I'm just trying to get as many of these as I can so I can custom tailor a world to something that I want. Like, Cave World, I know what it is now, and that's good. Void, I know what that is, and that was bad. So, don't do that. Um, I wonder if you could do Skylands and then Void and have it not, you know, put you on one block floating in the middle of the air. Um, with no way to get out. And we can make it, like, bright, so we don't have to worry about mobs, and then you can, you can do checkerboard biomes, and put, like, I don't know, um, oh, if you could get mountain biomes, with, like, ocean biomes, that'd be cool. Um, we could do, like, forest and, uh, mushroom island, and ice plains, and then just have it snow all the time so it all looks like mushroom, or so it all looks like ice plains. That'd be cool. I don't know. You could do some pretty cool things. And hopefully we'll get to do it the next time. Also, that this stuff stays with the notebook, so you can take the notebook out with you and put it in. You can't copy stuff directly from one notebook to another, so if I made another notebook and I put it in here, it would be empty. But I could copy stuff from here into a book, and then um, take this one out, put the new one in, and then copy it back over. I just have to make a bunch of new books. Or I wonder if I'd be able to make one book and just pour all of these things into it. Which would be interesting. But, I don't know. Anyway, I already said thank you for watching, didn't I? Crap, I do that a lot. Okay, thank you for watching, uh, for real this time. <laughs> um, I'll see you next time. Bye.